All right, Len Martez here with Spencer Snell. Popular guy, man. I had to wait a little bit to uh, to uh, to grab you, man. But you had a big night on, on Friday night. Seven catches in your in your first yes. NFL action preseason game. Explain that feeling for us. Oh, uh, it's a real humbling experience, actually. You know, going out there, I didn't expect to have seven catches for 119 yards. You know, I kind of just expected to go out there, kind of do my job and execute what came to me. And then those plays ended up coming. So you know, it was it was awesome. It was exciting. You know, my family was in the stands. So it was something that you know I'll be able to tell my kids as I grow up and. Um, just something that I want to kind of continue to build on as well going into next week so it was pretty awesome I can tell you from being out here two weeks of camp seeing number 83 your number constantly making plays catching the ball we spoke to wide receiver coach Kevin Garver today and he said that's one of the reasons why you stuck out of your tryout is that you don't you don't miss balls man right yeah that's something I've always since I was a young kid uh my dad played quarterback, and so he's out in the front yard throwing balls at me at, since I was a young kid. So he's always told me it's all about hand-eye coordination, watching the ball all the way in, and something I've really took pride in uh, growing up. So it's something that I, I really want to just always, ha always have is be that guy they know that uh, won't drop the ball, so they can trust me. And you know, going forward, just need to continue to do that. I also spoke to Coach Garvin today, and he, he stated the fact that <laughs> see this pop popular guy. There you go, as a quarterback right yep, there. Why right Griffin's there, showing there. love, but as far as you're concerned talked to coach coach Garvin today and he mentioned the fact that when you're a guy that's battling for that spot for that fifth sixth spot wide receiver wise gotta do a little extra as far as special teams concerned does that stick out to you too oh uh, yeah definitely um whether it's running down a kickoff kickoff return being the off returner or punt return you know I'm gonna give it my all in every phase of the game so um I know that I have to do that to make this team and those are things that I'm willing to do it doesn't matter what position I'm at I'm gonna do whatever to help the team so at the end of the day I'm just gonna Going to give it my all in every position, whether it's receiver, punt return, kickoff return, or kickoff. So, okay, I personally posted some some uh, videos on Twitter today. How to find you on Twitter? Tell folks your Twitter handle and explain. Uh, slot machine underscore eleven. Um, actually, back in I want to say back in uh, college, early, one of my coaches was like, when I got moved to slot, because in high school I played a little outside, a little inside. He was like, with all the production that you have, you should change your name to slot machine. So I was like, that sounds like a good idea. So. Shout out, shout out to him for that, but it was awesome just getting that and just being a productive receiver, having that in the slot, so it made me a slot machine. With that, where are you most comfortable? Are you most comfortable in the slot? Are you comfortable outside? Where do you like to, where do you like to be? Um, I like the slot, you know, being able to read the defense and find the holes in the middle of the field. I think that's where I, where I fit best, and uh, with my speed in this league, um, you have to be a very fast guy on the outside, so... You know, I'm kind of in that in-between stage of how fast I am. So I think working the middle of the field and, you know, being able to have a feel for the defenses is something that suits me really well in the slot. Okay, so Friday night you got your second preseason game. The Dolphins are going to be in town in the next three days. But Friday night you got your first game at Raymond James. You got a lot to live up to after what you did at Heinz Field on Friday night. Oh, yeah, I've definitely got a lot to live up to. So, you know, I'm just going to keep poised throughout the week, work hard, and, you know, be consistent and go out there uh, this upcoming Friday. And anytime the ball comes my way, I'm going to try to make the same exact plays. Remember the name, Spencer Snell. Man's been catching everything. Thank you. Good luck to you, man. Thank you.